It's a new children's book that is ideal for early readers and for parents looking for something to read to the kids. A Bear with Pants. Love this. <laughs> Touches on the theme of anti-bullying, kindness, and friendship. It's loaded with great illustrations and fun. Joining us now is the author, Adam Warren. Hey, Adam, good morning. Good morning. It's great having you. Thank you. A Bear with Pants. Tell us all about your book. It's a children's book. Mm -hmm. It's got an anti-bullying theme. It's something that uh, took me a long time to do, about four years to write this wow, little book. Okay. Wow. Working with an illustrator, uh, Zach Arnett, who did incredible work and somehow got in my head and took these words and translated them into 13 illustrations uh, on the inside and, of course, the cover. So 2013, 2014, what made you decide, you know what, I'm going to write a children's book? Mm -hmm. Well, you know, I have two girls. Yeah. Um, both had experienced it. Mm -hmm. I experienced it. In fact, uh, two of my front teeth were knocked out uh, wow. partially by a uh, result of bullying. And oh I wanted to create something that made a difference, that could help teach children something. And I hope to continue to uh, write different Bear With Pants books that teach children something uh, and make a lasting difference. But it's not a wow. harsh covering of bullying. If you hear it as a parent, oh, this is a bullying book. I'm not ready to introduce my kids to this just yet. Um, actually, it's a very soft touch on it and, it, and it really shows that there's a side that you can all come together and all unify around each other's, each other's differences. It, wow. Empathy. It really teaches empathy and you're, 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 it, this is uh, something that's a great read uh, for kids. Get them nice and early so you don't have to have that tougher message later down the line. Mm -hmm. Correct. It's perfect. Yeah. I feel really good about it. Neat. I bet it was a little bit therapeutic for you and probably good for you as a father to spend so much time on that theme. What was the best part for you about putting together the book for four years? Uh, I always had in my head that I was gonna have that book in my hand. I thrive on accomplishment. I love doing things I probably shouldn't be doing because I see <laughs> in the end that there's gonna be an end result. And mm. I was, this was something that I was really proud to do. And every night when I would come home and I would sneak off into my little home office and type out a few pages a day, um, I was just watching that whole maturation process and seeing it come to life. And, and, and that, that's only the half of it, though. You can write all you want. With a children's book, you have to have illustrations, and you have some great yes. illustrations. So let's take a look at them and explain what these are. Absolutely. So we've got two great scenes here. Uh, one of them is uh, the teacher and some of the students confronting those really mean snake with scarves who are the bullies here and telling them it's not acceptable. And then, you know, a lot of kids, they're the last to be picked in sports and uh, school, school games, baseball. And this is where you're finally seeing our, mm. our main character, a bear with pants, be chosen to play on the softball team. That's awesome. So you mentioned it's kind of a soft touch on bullying. What do you think the perfect age group for this book is? It's a pretty wide group because we're going to have parents who are reading this to uh, their children. It's a great story time, uh, bedtime book. And I would say pre-K all the way through fifth grade. Gotcha. There we go. Oh, there's, she's yeah. coming right. Well, I, I, take, <laughs> I took a look at it in the green room. And I, I mean, there's some significant reading here, too, if you're looking to boost your child's reading skills. This is, this is not a couple sentences. No doubt. This no, is, it's, yeah. it is, a, is good. It's a challenge read. Okay. Yeah. Definitely. Oh, I, and I would tell you that my daughters, who were much younger at the time, were also my copy editors. <laughs> and I would always say, here, take a look at this. And there was one time my daughter, my youngest, came to me and said, uh, Dad, snakes don't have hands. And I thought that was really funny because snakes also don't wear scarves. But I said, you know what? You're right. I'm going to erase it. No more hands. There we go. They do all the bullying with their Bears little Bears can wear tail. pants, though. That is totally That's fine. That's true. Yes. I mean, we Perfectly all know that acceptable. anyway. Exactly. Uh, you are actually going to be doing uh, readings, uh, or you've done some public readings for these books at Barnes & Noble uh, and at a charter school in New Orleans. Uh, how, how are the kids responding beyond your own, of course, your own, your own uh, group? You know, the, the Barnes & Noble... Um, was really interesting. It was my first time reading in a bookstore. It was such a mixture of kids' ages, yeah. and you mm -hmm. had anything from uh, kids who were sitting there captivated. One child came up and wrapped himself around my leg, oh. and um, I think one child was sleeping. But overall, you know, you're talking about a book that would take me about 18 minutes to read, and the they were very attentive, and I'll tell you where the, the bells really went off was in New Orleans. Those kids were captivated, they were excited, and they did not want me to miss a single word. That's oh, awesome. Oh, it's so neat. And I, I just paging through, I'm seeing there's so many fun characters. The book is available in quite a few places at this yes. point. Give yes, us an idea is. where. 
Well, you can go to bearwithpants.com, and there's a place to do it there. You can go to lulu.com, which is my publisher, and there's a 10% discount if you want to buy it through there. You just have to search my book and sign up. Uh, you go to Amazon. It's available digitally for the Kindles and Nooks, uh, iBooks, everywhere. Very cool. And you have a special yeah. offer today, don't you? Well, if you go to lulu.com, oh, that's yep. the 10% mm -hmm. off. And awesome. uh, I hope all your viewers go and check it out and take advantage of it. It's a great right. deal. It's very Thanks cool. Thanks for stopping by. Thanks for having me. This was fun. Pleasure. Good to have you in Vegas. Yeah. Get your hands on a copy of A Bear with Pants, probably the greatest literary name I've ever heard. It's awesome. <laughs> yeah. It's available on a bunch of retails you see on your screen. You can connect with Adam on his website. A Bear with Pants is also on Facebook and Instagram. They're a proud sponsor of the Morning Blog.